Hey, you guys, and welcome to Danica Marie and our dope discussions. Today, you guys are in for a treat. We are going to be discussing five easy ways for men to become more attractive to women. Okay. And the first thing that we have on our list, you guys, is for men to be more discreet. Okay. In a world where you have all of these guys being loud and boisterous and over the top and flashy, when a guy operates and maneuvers within this realm of mystique, and you know, he's very reserved into himself. Oh, that is so captivating. It really draws us women in and makes us want to gravitate towards you because we want to figure you out. We want to know what is it about you that allows you to not operate like all the other guys, especially when you are a well-to-do guy, because a lot of those well-to-do guys, they want to be over the top. They want to be the center of attention. You know, they want to be seen. But when you are the type of guy that is successful in your own right, you know, which means that you're operating from a place of being self-sufficient, you know, you're, you're focused, you're driven, you're ambitious, the whole nine. And yet you have this air about you to where you want to be to yourself. Oh, super sexy, super sexy, super sexy. It shows a level of maturity. It shows that you're careful. It, it shows that you're selective. And again, it's, it's adding to that um, woman feeling as though you're an exclusive type of guy, because what is it about you that makes you so reserved? What is it about you that makes you highly selective and very careful about the things that you share, uh, the people that you interact with, um, the things that you do? So being discreet is absolutely something that is extremely sexy and attractive on a man because it makes us women want to figure you out and get to know you better so that we can be on the quote unquote in crowd and we too can be exclusive because we have access to the man that is exclusive. Now, fellas, the next thing on our list that you guys can do to be more attractive to women that quite frankly, a lot of you guys may overlook because you feel like it's not that important or women are not really paying attention to it. And we are. We pay attention. Take care of your skin, okay? A lot of you guys skip over this small but very important detail and step as far as being more attractive to women. You know, outside of keeping your hair presentable or your beard uh, tamed and groomed or your mustache or your clothes, your shoes and all of that, you have got to take care of your skin. Fellas, we are watching you. We see that acne. We see those blemishes, okay? We see the dryness. We see the flakes. We see all of it. And honestly, fellas, it's a turnoff when a guy is not making sure that his skin is being presentable. It's like, yeah, he got every, he has everything else under control, but oh, I can't look past the bad skin, you know? And a lot of you may have been getting passed up by women and you you can't figure out like, what is it? Like, why aren't women checking for me? Sir, it's your skin, okay? Um, and I believe this is because on some subconscious level or conscious level, when you have bad skin, it triggers it into a woman's mind that maybe you don't really take care of your hygiene. Maybe you're not that sanitary, you know, like that is what is at play when we are dealing with a guy that has bad skin. So fellas, you have got to take care of your skin. And luckily for you guys, okay, 
we do have a solution if you just so happen to be one of those guys out there that does have skin issues and acne issues. And, you know, you didn't know that this was something that was hindering you from being attractive to women. Um, and like I said, you guys, luckily we do have a great sponsor today and stay tuned and watch this. And I'm telling you guys, it's going to be a life changer for you. You guys, it is absolutely imperative for you to take care of your skin. Now, luckily for you guys, today's dope discussion is being sponsored by one of the best skincare systems out there for men just like you. And that amazing skincare system just so happens to be Teach Hanley. Now, what makes them so special is they're going to make this entire process of maintaining your clear, healthy, sexy, vibrant, attractive skin extremely uncomplicated. Now, I highly recommend you guys to start with their level one system, which comes with all of the basics. It's going to come with a daily face wash to get rid of dirt and grime on your skin a two time per week exfoliating scrub to get rid of dead skin cells. It's gonna also come with a morning moisturizer with a STF 20 because you should always be protecting your skin from the sun. And you guys, it's also gonna come with a nighttime moisturizer just to help your skin stay hydrated and healthy throughout the night. Now, my absolute favorite part about T. Chanley is that every box comes with an instruction card that tells you when to use each product, how much to use, and in what order to use them in. Like, they really make this entire process super easy. And there's actual proof that their products are amazing. All you have to do is head on over to their website and check out over 5,000 five-star reviews from people from all over the world. And in addition to amazing skin, members of Teach Hanley get tons of benefits, including at least a 20% off retail price, the ability to customize your box, exclusive monthly deals, and you can pause or cancel at any time with free U.S. shipping and low-cost shipping to most other countries. And you guys, because Tiege Hanley is sponsoring today's video, they're offering my viewers an amazing deal. Just click the first link in the description and you'll get 30% off your first box plus a free gift. Click that link and get started today. All right, you guys, so make sure that you are making that investment into your skincare. That way you can be more attractive to women. Now, moving along to the third thing on our list as far as being more attractive to women is to be self-sufficient, all right? This means that you're able to maintain and sustain on your own without having to rely on anybody else. You have all of your needs met, all of your wants met, and guess what? You're not having to beg anybody to get it. That is super sexy, super attractive on a man, all right? Especially because as a man, you're supposed to be on your purpose. You're supposed to be self-sufficient. You're supposed to be able to take care of yourself. And it's so many guys out there, you guys, unfortunately, that they just don't have their stuff together. And so you can really set yourself apart by being the guy that has his own money, has his own place, has his own car, you know, is focused, ambitious, successful, like he's driven to success, driven to succeed, super sexy. And all women love men that are like that. Okay. Because it's in a female's nature to look for stability and security. And so if a man is self-sufficient, oh, he's a winner. He's a keeper. He's attractive. Fellas, the next thing on our list, as far as what you guys can do to be more attractive to women and I know it would be a lot of women out there that would maybe have an issue with me saying this, but I'm going to go ahead and say it anyway, because it's the truth. 
don't chase a woman. Do not chase the woman. I don't care how attractive you think that she is. I don't care how much you like her, desire her, whatever. You do not chase her. When you chase her, it places it into our minds that you are desperate and maybe you don't have a lot going for you. Contrary to popular belief, you guys, women love to be kept on their toes and we love a little bit of a challenge. Now, I'm not saying that you should not pursue a woman or you should ignore her or act like she doesn't exist or don't give her any attention. I'm not saying that. I'm saying don't chase up behind her. Leave room for her to extend um, an invitation out to you, to talk to you, to get into communication with you, to hang out with you. It has to be a two-way street, all right? And the reason why I'm telling you guys that this makes you more attractive is because a lot of guys always are being thirsty for a girl and chasing up behind her, especially when she's an attractive woman. It's very predictable and typical and, you know, it can get boring after a while. And so what would set a guy apart is the guy that is showing interest, but he's also um, allowing us to, again, check up behind him to see what he's about. You know, it shows us that maybe he has options. Maybe he's a busy guy which equates to that guy being on his purpose. Somebody that is driven and focused on maybe building his finances or establishing himself. Like you're preoccupied with other things that are of importance to you, you know? And so it's very sexy when a guy is not spending all of his time chasing up behind women, chasing up behind a female. Even if that woman is us and we like you back, you know, and we're interested in you, it's very, very attractive when that guy, once again, can create some kind of space and boundaries um, to allow the woman to check up behind him. Um, because we're, a lot of us, quite frankly, we're just not used to that. You know, it keeps us on our toes. It keeps us guessing a little bit, not too much, because again, you're still showing interest. But at the same time, it shows that you have enough. Um, esteem about yourself to where, you know, you're allowing somebody else to pursue you back, you know? So never chase up behind a woman, pursue her. Yes. Show her that you're interested. Yes. But never become overbearing and never continuously go out of your way to seek her out. Allow her to do that for you as well. Because again, we're not used to that. And again, it shows that, you know, you respect yourself. You know, you respect yourself enough to make a woman check up on you as well. All right. So don't chase a woman. Pursue her. Don't chase. All right, fellas. And so the last and final thing that you guys can do to be more attractive to women is to work out. All right. Now, I would take it a step further and say, practice an overall healthy lifestyle. I'm talking about eating right, working out, um, fasting, taking care of your skin, all of that. Okay. Um, but I would say to work out a lot of men just, they don't take care of themselves body wise, physique wise. Fellas, we love muscles just like you guys love slim waist and curves. Like we want our men to be in shape. You know, it's so sexy when a guy, you know, can have on his muscle shirts or, you know, can, can show off some abs or some nice biceps and triceps, some nice shoulders, a nice back, nice pecs, like the whole nine. Like, please get in the habit of working out. And I would go ahead and say, practicing an overall healthy lifestyle. We want our men to uh, not only look great, we want them to feel great too. We want them to be energetic. We want them to have stamina, okay? All of that can be taken care of by practicing an overall healthy lifestyle, okay? So please do that. That is probably um, the most important thing to take care of yourself 
and practice a, a healthy lifestyle, you know? Um, not only do you look good on the eyes, but again, like you're going to have a good energy and a good presence to you as well, because you're going to feel good. You're going to be vibrant. You're going to be your best self. You're going to feel your best self. So please fellas do not sleep on the fact that you should be practicing a healthy lifestyle. And at the very least taking care of that body, baby, again, us ladies, we love a man that looks good in a nice little t-shirt, all right? Especially when they're those tight little, t like, we like that, okay? So work out, eat right, take care of your skin. Um, yeah, all of that is going to help you to be more attractive, okay? But you guys, you guys let me know how y'all felt about this quick little dope discussion. And what things have you implemented into your life to be more attractive to women? All right. Were you hitting on majority of this list? If not all, you know, were you not practicing some of these things? Y'all let me know. And, you know, again, you guys feel free to head on over to Teach Hanley and please invest in your skincare. It is so attractive and necessary. All right. It's not only going to make you be more appealing and more attractive to women, but you're going to feel good. You're going to feel more confident, which is another thing that contributes to you being more attractive to women. So just take care of yourself, you guys. But again, y'all let me know how y'all feel about this quick, dope discussion. What would you add to this list as far as, you know, being more attractive to women? Let's talk about it. And I'll see you guys in the next dope discussion. Peace, y'all.